Hi guys, I'm Dr. Sandhya Ramanathan and I'm a GP in Greylin in Auckland. And today I thought I'd just go through with you a few different disinfectant solutions and how to make them up so that um, you and your family can stay safe as we navigate through this COVID-19 pandemic. Now we all know that washing our hands for 20 seconds with soap or detergent is very good at killing coronavirus. This is because uh, the coronavirus belong to a group of viruses that have a fatty envelope and the soap very effectively um, destroys this fatty envelope and deactivates the virus. Now, unfortunately, it's not so easy to wash all our surfaces um, and our possessions uh, that uh, may have come in contact uh, with um, external viruses or bacteria with soap and water. So we need to have some different disinfectant solutions ready at home um, so that we can make sure that they are all clean. Now, I personally prefer whatever disinfectant solution you're gonna make up to put it into a spray bottle. The reason for this is number one, in order to effectively kill the virus, generally you need to soak the area for 10 seconds. So just um, putting a solution onto a, a cloth, say a microfiber cloth, which you can then go and wash in the washing machine, which is great, um, is not necessarily actually gonna clean your surface properly. However, if you put it into a spray bottle, for example, then you can easily um, saturate the surface, leave it there for 10 seconds and then wipe it off. And then you can be happy that you've actually um, killed any coronavirus that may be left on that surface. Now, the number one option um, in terms of ease and safety on most um, surfaces would have to be isopropyl alcohol. Now, you can get this at pharmacies, um, and I've also seen it at some supermarkets. Um, this contains 70 or 75% alcohol. And if you put it into a spray bottle, uh, which is clearly labelled, um, then this is very easy to use on things such as your phone surface, um, your handbag, um, you know, the kid's school bag. Um, and generally, um, it's, it's not going to cause any damage and it's just going to evaporate. You don't even have to wipe it off. Obviously, on, on um, a surface which you've saturated like your phone, after 10 seconds, you can take a tissue or a cloth and you can wipe it off. Okay, so that would be your number one preference if you can find it. This is a very good one to have at home. Now, um, after isopropyl alcohol, um, the next uh, most commonly found one, I would say, uh, would be uh, just um, methylated spirits. Methylated spirits is um, about 95% alcohol. So in order to um, be effective as a cleaner, you only need it at about 70% concentration. So all you need to do is get a one litre spray bottle which you can get from Bunnings or Mitre 10. And they usually have the um, uh, measures marked on the side. So here I've filled it up with um, pure methylated spirits to 700 mils. And now I'm going to dilute, dilute that and I've just put a little funnel and with 300 mils of water. And this will just reduce the concentration because you have to be a little bit careful with methylated spirits. Uh, I managed to um, disintegrate one of my phone covers when I was um, early on in uh, the pandemic when I was getting quite keen with the methylated spirits. So now I've switched to alcohol wipes or uh, the isopropyl alcohol, but uh, um, it wasn't so freely available then. And make sure that you clearly label. So here I've labeled, this is approximately 70% methylated spirits. And um, I've clearly labelled it. And if you have young children, it needs to be kept um, high out and out of reach. Uh, and this one I'm planning to use to spray on my kids' school bags and their shoes when they come home from school. Apart from that, very common, um, you can find, obviously, sodium hypochlorite solution, uh, which is um, Janola, household bleach. Janola, which is available in New Zealand, is usually a 4% concentration. And in order to make up a disinfectant solution uh, with the Janola, you need 25 mils of 4% Janola in one litre of water. So 25 mils uh, means that's approximately five teaspoons because um, there's uh, five mils in one teaspoon. So you need five teaspoons of 
pure Janola in one litre of cold water. And again, you can make that up in another spray bottle. And last but not least, um, one of my favourites is um, Dettol. Dettol is nice, it's got a good fragrance and it's got the um, dilution instructions on the back. And here it says that um, you need two capfuls in one litre of water. And here I have, and I like using this one on my kitchen bench surfaces. Um, um, obviously I saturate it and then I wipe it off um, and make sure that the surface is all clean and ready for food preparation. So um, the other thing that Dettol does have a nice product, which is um, Glen 20 spray. Um, this is all ready to go in a spray and smells very nice. And you can use this um, just as a quick door handle, you know, um, uh, you know, taps and again, spray it, wipe it off. Um, and so this is another one which is easily available. So there you have it. Um, actually, I managed to give you five different disinfectant solutions. I will um, put the instructions in, in the comment box below. So just remember, if we know the enemy, we know how to fight it.